Okay, it is uh, June the 2nd in 2011, and it's uh, a little after 2 p.m., and I'm going to do something that's a little against my better judgment, but I did see where starlings like to frolic in water. So we're going to try something here with with uh, w, WB. He's just been behaving himself up here, and I'm going to put him down here on this plate of water and see what he thinks of that. Oh, right here. Whoop. Got to train that up. Okay, let's see what he thinks. See if he wants to frolic in the water. Give him a second to adjust. And I've gotten him some bird seed and he's been pecking a little bit at the bird seed. So I think he's learning to eat yeah, let's see. You could, uh, yeah, you see the water. I just got some generic seed that's uh, for all birds. It's got mixed fruit and nuts and peanuts. I think uh, kind of crushed up. And here's the bird seed right here. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, here. It's got little bits of uh, fruit, I think, and nuts and. And it's in the package it said it had peanuts, but it was just generic for all birds. He has been eating that a little bit. And he actually, when I brought him his, uh, his soaked cat food, he actually put his uh, head down and started eating it right out of the... There we go. There we go. Oh, here we go. Let's see what happens here. Definitely likes the water. Oh, yeah, that's right. Poop in the water. <laughs> that's probably not a good idea if you're going to be playing in the water. But like I said, it was against my better judgment. <laughs> but I did see, also read, that uh, starlings are, are legal to keep as pets. I believe what I read that they are an invasive species. I think that's what it said. And um, they are they can be kept as pets. So I, I'll have to check that out a little better. But um, and then also I believe uh, I found out how to tell the gender. And I thought I had it figured out, but now that I see his eye in the light. I might have to re reassess this, but um, I'll show you a couple pictures here um, as to how you tell the gender of a starling, and it involves looking at the eye, and if you can see a brown band around the pupil, in other words, if you can see the... the um, the iris, brown iris, that means it's more than likely a female. If the, the band around the pupil is dark, then we have a male. While I've been changing the memory card, he had been eating this bird seed, which I think is a good sign because this is the first I've seen him actually do that. I think yesterday he was kind of pecking around a little bit. Can we get you to eat some of this stuff? See what happens here. Eat some of this. Here. There you go. Let's see if you can see your eye and determine what gender you are. I'm pretty sure you're a male. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Because I don't see a real distinct brown ring around the pupil. Oh, yeah. See now how we stretch our wings? And you like your water. Yeah? What? What? 
Oh yeah, that's good. That's good. Yeah, I read online that they make good pets that they're um, they like to entertain, dance around, and, and sing, and um, they actually can be taught to speak or to um, yeah speak, talk. If they were kept as a pet, you need a large you need a large large cage for them. What are we doing here? Are we are we playing? Oh, don't tell me you're hungry. Okay. Come on. You're done? How about one more? One more? Oh. Okay. Oh. Yeah. maintenance.